The operator of the damaged Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant began test running a system to cool a spent fuel storage pool at the number four reactor on Sunday. The pool holds 1,535 fuel rods, the most for any of the plant's reactors. A hydrogen blast on March 15th damaged a wall supporting the pool. The temperature of the pool water remained high at 86 to 87 degrees Celsius on Friday. Tokyo Electric Park Company began reinforcing the wall with steel pillars and concrete in late May. It also started setting up a cooling device with a heat exchanger in mid-July. This is designed to establish a circulatory cooling system that pumps water out of the pool, cools the water and returns it to the pool. The preparatory work ended on Saturday. TEPCO began test running the cooling system on Sunday and hopes to start full operation if no problem occurs. The company intends to reduce the temperature of the pool water to around 30 to 40 degrees within a month. A similar cooling system is in place for spent fuel pools at the number two and number three reactors. And TEPCO wants to test run a cooling system for the number one reactor no later than early August.